an alarming case of embezzlement affecting students in Madison Heights. It's led to the firing of a high-level administrator and a police investigation. 7 Action News reporter Simon Shaquette shows us how the parents were notified and how the district learned what happened. This letter sent to parents just obtained by 7 Action News, written by the superintendent of the Madison School District, delivering a bombshell of broken trust, leaving parents like Tim Hobbs outraged. I think it's wrong. I don't think they should be doing that. I think there should be some kind of consequences. Parents expressing their anger after learning the director of business and finance was terminated after disclosing he used district funds for personal use. One parent asked not to be identified while sharing her own sense of betrayal. As a parent learning that that trust was broken by somebody in charge of the money, what goes through your mind? It's absolutely heartbreaking considering the schools are already low funded. They don't get enough money as is. After declining to do an interview, the superintendent sent us a statement saying their employee admitted back on April 3rd to improperly taking funds. They were terminated immediately and police were called. Police Chief Corey Haynes says the investigation into felony embezzlement is very active, but so far there's been no arrest. Right now we're looking at around twenty to $25,000, but it, it could increase. As we speak, police are investigating how long alleged thefts of funds date back and how it happened. They plan to turn over all of their findings to prosecutors as soon as possible. It's important to note that a forensic audit is going to be done on the district next week. Are you wondering how this happened? Yeah, I'm definitely wondering. The school district's letter promises transparency and to continue doing good work on behalf of students. From Madison Heights, Simon Shaykat, 7 Action News.